Hi everyone, my name is Sanjeev. In this video, I want to demonstrate database connectors, walk insert, walk update, and walk delete operations. In bulk operation, instead of sending one record at a time, we send many records to insert, update, and delete the data in database. This improves the performance because for each and every record, we don't have to pass the query and we don't need to get the new database connection for each and every record. We send all the records to the database using single invocation. For demo, I will move to the AnyPoint Studio now. I have created a Mule project, database bulk operation. In this project, I have three flows. First one to insert the records in bulk to the Oracle database. Second one to update the records in bulk. And third one to delete the records in the bulk. I have a bulk insert resource that I have created using HTTP listener. Then I'm using bulk insert operation from database connector, bulk insert operation. Bulk insert operation takes payload for the input parameter and this payload need to be array, array of the JSON object and here is the SQL query. In this query, I'm going to insert records, many records, any student master table and these are the column and these are the parameter. And I'm going to insert these uh, records in my local Oracle database. So let me show you the configuration. So I'm using local Oracle database and this is service name xcpdv1 and I have configured the Oracle JDBC driver, Maven dependency. So I'm using our artifact OJDBC 11. This I'm setting this uh, using my local jar. Let me run the project. So this project is getting deployed in the embedded runtime. Project has been deployed. Let me go to the Oracle developer tool. And here is my student database. And there is a table a student master. And right now there is no rows there. Once I will invoke the walk insert resource, you will see the records here. So I'm going to copy the payload from the notepad that I have already built it. So this is a JSON array because bulk operation takes the array. So I'm copying this payload. So here I'm going to invoke bulk insert operation using bulk insert resource. I'm copying the JSON array. So I'm going to insert student name Matthew, John, Todd, David and Krish. So these are five students I want to insert and all these students are in 11th class. And right now you can see in developers tool there is no student there in a student master table. So I'm going to the postman, I'm going to click send. 
you can see that five records has been inserted you can go back to developer tool refresh it and we can see that the five records has been inserted using single invocation we have matthew john todd david and krish and they all are actually in the 11th class now i'm going back to the anypoint studio i have created a resource for updating the records in bulk resource is bulk minus update and i am using bulk update operation to update the records many records in a single call it takes the payload which is a array of the json objects and this is a sql query here i am updating class using class parameter for a particular student name and database connector have the bulk update operation that's what i'm using here so i will copy the payload request payload for update here i am uh, updating class for all the student from 11 to 12 right now all students are in class 11 i am updating all student to class 12 so i am going to the postman i will invoke the bulk underscore update resource and i will send this uh, json array as a payload so this payload have five records for each students the class will be updated so let me show you in the developer oracle developer all students right now in the class 11 once i will update this using bulk operation they all will go to the class 12 let me refresh it you can see it's a, they are in a class 11 so i'm going to the postman and going to send this request to the deployed project so all five records has been updated we can go back to the oracle developer and i will refresh it so you can see that all student right now in the 12th class so we have updated all five records now i will demonstrate the bulk delete operation for bulk delete operation i have created the resource bulk minus delete i am using bulk delete operation bulk delete operation also takes payload which is a array of the json object so we need to send the array of the json object and this is a sql query for delete so i am deleting student master for particular id because i will send the json array so multiple records will be deleted i'm going to the notepad and copy the payload this is a array of json object go to the postman and here i will invoke the bulk minus delete resource so i'm sending five json object five record ids and they will be deleted you can observe the record id in the sql developer they are 107 115 123 131 139 and that's what we are sending 
139. So I'm going to click send. So five records had been deleted without any issue. I'll go back to the Oracle developer. I will refresh it and we can see our records has been deleted. So this is all in this demo. You can see that we can uh, delete, we can update, we can insert records using bulk operations, which improves the performance because we can manage multiple records using single invocation, using single uh, database connection. And for each records, database not need to pass the query. It passed only once and sends the all the records in a single invocation. This improves the performance. I hope you understood how to use the bulk operation to insert, update and delete records in the database. If you like this video, subscribe and click the like button. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.